gravestones of granite, wood and steel stand. Monuments to those who once stood inscribed. Words to loved ones long since passed away. From this veil of tears and into their eternal rest. Sunlight in dappled hue sometimes through the leaves on the trees falls. Shining upon the gravestones casting shadows. Stretching out until one shadow touches another. Lovers embracing in death in this lifeless place. A weeping angel stands with hands in prayer. Interceding for the soul of the one who lies beneath. Deep in the soil now just bones, flesh decayed. A once proud life now is at eternal rest, asleep. Skulls carved into the memorial stones stare out. A reminder of mortality in our own impending doom. Showing us that we should enjoy each dawning day. Carpe diem, for not one shall leave this earth alive. An urn on top of a marble column of alabaster cloth, draped around caressing the gravestone top. Ornate metal rails surround the grave now rusting. The workmanship of one long gone remains intact. Gravestones shaped like books, with pages open with only one side of the page filled in, in memoriam. The other page still blank, awaiting the next inscription of the one still living, who has yet to breathe their last. A Celtic cross stands tall by a nearby wooden cross, crucifix with rosary beads carved with reverence, looking over the grave which states, just sleeping, always loved, always missed, in our hearts. Can a life so vibrant suddenly forever be silent? Only a memorial stone to say that you once lived. A pathetic end for a once proud, breathing flesh, now enveloped in the earth's cold grip, alone. Who knows where this lifetime ends or begins? How many times do we live only to die once more? To be reborn, taken from death back to life. Start again on the treadmill from cradle to grave. Could this be the only life that we have in which to learn? We will never know until we part this veil of death. But then with sober thought, perhaps just darkness, with nothing beyond, just eternal death, the end.